This morning, a new investigation into the office of Harris County Judge Lena Hidalgo. Newly unsealed court documents that we have obtained show the Texas Rangers want to know if Hidalgo staffers hid evidence from a grand jury. KPRC 2's TJ Parker is live outside of Hidalgo's office downtown with more on what that search warrant reveals. Good morning, TJ. Hey, good morning. Yeah, three of Hidalgo's high level staffers are already indicted on a multi million dollar COVID vaccine contract that was awarded to a company called Elevate Strategies. And now the Texas Rangers are looking into whether those staffers purposely hid or even got rid of evidence that a grand jury demanded from them. Given the four corners of the affidavit and the warrant, it would appear to be a reasonable deduction that Judge Hidalgo's DNA is now in play in this investigation. This morning, allegations that the highest office in Harris County didn't turn over documents and communications that a grand jury subpoenaed. The Texas Rangers started investigating in 2021 after questions of fairness in awarding a nearly $11 million COVID vaccine contract to Elevate Strategies, a company that scored worse and cost more than others, including UT Health. That contract ultimately got revoked. This is a essentially the sequel to the original investigation that culminated in indictments of three members of Judge Hidalgo's staff. Documents claim Hidalgo's office used personal phones to talk about the contract, but deleted messages and didn't turn other records over during grand jury proceedings that led to the indictments last year. Investigators also say draft documents obtained during that investigation show the county judge herself edited the scope of the project to include mentions of the company that got selected two weeks before publicly announcing it. In a previous statement, Hidalgo says, quote, News reports have already shown that recent accusations suffer from a serious lack of understanding of the facts. My team will remain on my staff and continue to make meaningful positive changes on behalf of the people of Harris County. It is no coincidence that these unfair allegations are being leveled against them in the middle of an election year. So these new potential crimes that are being investigated are third degree felonies, which are punishable by up to 10 years in prison. We did email her office at seven o'clock last night. That's Lena Hidalgo's office for an interview. She was already confirmed actually to be on KPC, KPRC 2's newsmaker programs, a taping of that this morning at nine o'clock. Again, we are still waiting to hear back from her on that if, or if she has anything else to say. Uh, of course, we'll be sure to bring that to you once we have any more on that. So we're live downtown. I'm TJ Parker, KPRC 2 News.